Welcome to this versus that from Cinch, where we put two household items head to head to give you a better idea of what's best for your home sweet home. Today we're talking about a part of the home that is very necessary, but maybe one you just don't want to think about a whole lot, the toilet. Specifically, we're going to take a look at tanked toilets versus tankless toilets. First things first, let's look at how they work. In the past, toilet systems usually had a tank and a bowl. These tanks used to be provided with water to move the waste in the toilet bowl through a siphon system and into the drainage system of your home. Tankless toilets do not have a tank to store water, but still function like a tank toilet. But they do differ in several ways, like their flushing system. In a conventional tank toilet, the tank sits above the bowl to allow gravity to draw down the water in the tank for use in flushing the toilet. Afterwards, the tank refills with water for the next flush. A tankless toilet does not need a tank because it doesn't need to store water. Instead, it's hooked up to the building's plumbing system and flushes in one of two ways. Either water enters the bowl at a high pressure directly from the plumbing pipes or an electric pump in the toilet bowl, which provides additional pressure for the flush. Which brings us to our next question. What about water usage? The tank toilet is known to utilize more water than the tankless. Some tankless models even allow you to determine how many gallons of water you want to use per flush. As a result, you'll be able to save more water in the long run and thereby save more money. Nice not to have to flush that money down the toilet. Next, let's talk about size and look, important factors for a nice bathroom. A tank toilet will consume more space than a tankless because the tank toilet already comes with its own tank for water storage. So a tankless might be more suitable for a small bathroom. Now let's talk about something super important with any home addition, price. If you want to install either of these toilets, you have to set a budget for it. For the ordinary tank toilet, the price is relatively lower compared to a tankless toilet. You'll also need to hire a plumber to install a tankless toilet, whereas most tank models you can do on your own. Lastly, let's talk about maintenance and durability. No one likes repair work and every toilet needs to be maintained so it can remain in good condition for longer. However, the tankless toilet is easy to maintain as it is hardly going to develop leakage or other issues. This makes it desirable for most homeowners who are looking for a low maintenance toilet. So which toilet is better and why? Well, it all depends on your various needs from design to budget. But if you have a little more money to spend up front, a tankless toilet is better value due to its water usage reduction, fewer maintenance issues, and overall more modern look. The things we covered here today are just a few things to consider when deciding what toilet is best for your household. But whichever you pick, Cinch is always around to help you keep it in tip-top shape. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos like this.